The BG Wizards are a well-known bag used by elite level pros all the way down to, to amateurs and rec players. And it's, it's widely used for good reason. It's a great bag. It does a lot of things that a lot of people like to do in today's cornhole game, but they're not always available. And if you're gonna play ACO events this year, whether it's opens, regionals, whatever, majors, regionals, whatever, you've got to use an ACO stamp bag, or maybe the price tag on the Wizards is just a little bit too high for you. I've got a great option uh, we're gonna talk about. Let's get into it. So a bag I added to my lineup this year, uh, you guys saw it in my, in my bag lineup for the ACO season, is the CBC Impact. In my opinion, this is a, a wizard replacement, if not a wizard improvement. Um, I've seen, I'm not great at doing a lot of the fancy shots that you can do with these kind of carpet bags, that herringbone carpet. However, I've taken these to some blind draws, seen some guys that I, that I play around and play with that can do those things, really, really make these things dance and do some things that uh, the wizards can do and the wizards are well known for. So looking for an alternative to that, I think this is as close as you can get right here. The great thing about these, these come in at the 80 to $90 price tag rather than over $100 a lot of times for the Wizards. And also, like I said, if you're gonna play ACO events at all, you're gonna need a set or two of these because you gotta have that ACO stamp right there to be able to play in those ACO, whether it's regionals or whether it's the majors. So let's get into a little bit of the characteristics of the bag. It's got that herringbone carpet, just like the Wizards have. And it's got a fast side, very similar. The, on the website, these say 8.5. Mike's Bags, great channel, did a review, a full review of these bags. All the technical specs, I can link it in the description so you can go over there and watch his review of these as well. But I think they're closer to a 5.5, 8.5, or even a, a 6.9, like, just like the Wizards. But they play great on fast boards or slow boards. You can still make them get up the board. And you can make these these bags that you know the reason people love the wizards is you can make these bags get around bags roll you can roll with these uh, and things like that i've developed a little bit of a get around bag i can cut both directions uh, not super consistent but i can do it i can do it when i need to and that right to left um, or left to right cut is way easier because my natural throw is to do that that handshake kind of that rookie motion anyway so the bag is going to come out like that so I think that's kind of natural to develop that shot first. But I've been working on flipping that hand over to where it's coming in and I'm getting that reverse cut uh, coming right to left as well. So this bag will do that. If you can just get a little bit of an angle on it, you can make that thing move around bags that are on the board and, and do some things. Now I've seen it, I've accidentally flop shot it, rolled out here in the yard, but I can't do it on purpose. Some guys I played with in a blind draw uh, where I've let them use these. Man, they make this thing jump over a couple of bags uh, in front of it. So great roll bag if you're good at doing that. You know, they say with carpet bags in general, you've got to be flat. And that, that, that'll that hold true for these. These these won't absolutely destroy you if you're not perfectly flat. Uh, but I, I seem to be able to throw a flat bag with these as good or better than any other bags I have. And I think that goes back to, I love how these feel in my hand. Of all the cornhole bags I've owned so far, these feel the best when I'm, when I'm holding them, getting ready to throw. It's, I don't know if it's the materials, the fullness, whatever. They feel just right uh, in the hand. So that gives me confidence before I let them go so I can get that thing to come out and, and spin right and, and lay flat in the air. And with, like in any sport, I think confidence is key. So if you feel confident stepping up there before you even throw, you're, you're already ahead of the game. So I'd like to know, does anybody else have any wizard wizard dupes or wizard copies out there? I, I wouldn't even call these a wizard copy. Just that's the the most popular brand on the ACL side that you can compare these to. But I think these standalone is a really good bag, a really good option you should consider over with CBC on the Corn Slingers Bag Company website. I'll link that in the description as well. But if you guys ever played with CBC, let me know what you think of the impacts. I know there's some other models that, out there that they make that are fantastic as well. Uh, go check them out. But hey, as always, appreciate y'all watching. I'll have another video up soon.